Hey there. So I just did a video recently showing the virtual streaming space. I just wanted to go through a little bit of the setup. Um, so one of the things I wanted to cover was for the face and eye tracking, I'm using the Oculus Quest Pro and its cutting edge features. So this enables me to be able to look around the room, read notes, also be able to speak and get my lips all captured as well. Um, Hand tracking is available on a majority of headsets. The Quest Pro, like, as you can see, picks up the fingers pretty well. You can even crush your hands over and it picks up on the tracking there. There are no other external sensors or cameras required to capture this movement. It is all using the built-in sensors that handle everything. Um, so this allows the virtual stream space to have full motion tracking just by wearing the Oculus Quest Pro headset. Uh, one of the other things I want to mention is if you're using another headset through this system, um, it will default to using um, static eye contact and will use lip syncing, so utilizing the sound to move the mouth. I'll have a demo of that in a second. So here we have the face and eye tracking turned off. So it's still making my mouth move, but it's based purely on the sounds that it's making. And when I look around the room, the eyes, you can tell, are just looking forward. So I hope this gives a good example of how it looks without the face and eye tracking on. Hey, so one other thing I wanted to show is if we switch over to camera one. So with these cameras, they're actually virtual cameras within this space. They're not, um, they're not physical cameras in the real world. So that's how we can be able to grab and move these cameras around. Just one other thing I wanted to show about how this whole system works. So this gives a bit more flexibility of if you want another camera, you would be able to just add it within the scene and have it viewed in a different way. So I hope that gives a bit more explanation of how the cameras work within this scene. Thank you very much. So in this section, I thought I'd do a quick overview of the setup. For the physical setup, I had a Quest Pro, the standalone VR headset. Um, and this removed the requirement of any additional sensors or cameras, making it a hassle-free choice for the VR streaming. And a PC. Um, having a compatible PC is necessary for certain functionalities like desktop streaming and virtual webcam setup. Configuration for streaming. We've got the network set up by installing the Oculus app on my PC. That allows a connection between the Quest headset and the computer. And we also used OBS Studio. And this allows for recording of the scene and can also be used as a virtual camera if another system is not picking up on the virtual stream camera. Integration with other tools. So for the desktop streaming, it was pretty simple. Um, the feed goes straight into the app. You just need to select the display you wish to share. For the virtual webcam setup, you need to run a specific file on your PC to make that webcam available as an option through various applications. For virtual video calls, I tested the webcam and desktop streaming for Facebook Messenger and Microsoft Teams um, as a proof of concept. Some practical tips I just want to point out as well for this setup is having a clear space around three and a half by three and a half meters is ideal for an unrestricted VR experience. And making sure when you set up your virtual environment, setting up the boundaries correctly to ensure the physical area is clear and avoid accidental collisions with walls or other items. Hey, thank you very much for watching this and I really hope that it helped you understand how all of this environment works and the advantages you have of being able to do this sort of environment in VR. Um, I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you have any feedback or questions, please leave them below. Um, and please like and subscribe if you really enjoy this content and I'll try and create more of this. Thank you very much for watching. See you later.